with any label you put on yourself, just being a little careful so that you don't take it to an extent where right. you just kind of lose yourself and you become Because some this. people can like very identify with introversion and then that becomes who they are. And then right. they, they live life only according to that like definition. And exactly. the truth is we're all on the spectrum between introversion yeah. and extroversion. And Definitely. what the pandemic has taught me is even though I'm an introvert, I do value human connection and I do need to see my friends and, and speak to other people once in a while, maybe just less than extroverts do, but you know, it's still in everyone. <laughs> yeah. I mean, yeah. totally. I, I definitely agree, you know, and I think when I was very deep into introversion, like reading about it a lot, a lot, I kind of became that person who was like, oh, now I kind of feel like meeting up with my friends. But then I was like, wait, am I an introvert if I want to meet up with all my friends four times this week? And it's like, that's not what it's about. Yeah. So I'm just trying to avoid that overall. Cause I think, you know, I used to be like, I'm an introvert. I am a vegan. I am this, I am that. And that's fine. You know, some people enjoy feeling that kind of belonging and identifying with the group. And sometimes it can be helpful. But for me personally, I found that it's, it's not very helpful. It actually makes me kind of feel boxed in and restricted. And I just don't want to feel that way. 